Mark and Ingrid. Whether it's live now or later today on Facebook Time for the Hollywood Hot Seat. Brought to you by Carpet One, Coleman Street, Belleville, the one store for your perfect floor. Jennifer Lopez, Steven Tyler are finding the downside of sending so many people to Hollywood. They got to send twice as many home. Ryan Seacrest says 327 contestants got golden tickets, twice as many as normal, but that means you got to eliminate yeah. twice as many. The Seth Rogen lookalike made it, so did the guy with Tourette's and Asperger's syndromes. The guy whose fiance was wheelchair bound from an accident. The bar mitzvah singer made it, but not Miss Teen USA 2009. The accountant was sent home, as was the girl who brought Randy Jackson's old football coach into her first, first audition. And the White House intern stays. 159 contestants sent packing. Charlie Sheen can consider himself divorced. His divorce from Brooke Mueller Sheen is final, but because of legalities, the two of them won't be single in the eyes of the law until May 2nd. They filed dueling divorce petitions back in November. Both said they separated Christmas Day 2009. Uh, that was the day Charlie was arrested in Colorado on suspicion of domestic violence against his wife. He later resolved the case and spent 30 days on probation. The prenup will see Charlie pay Brooke more than three quarter of a million dollars and 55 a grand, 55 grand a month in child support. Wow! Yikes! Yeesh. That's not even what he's already paying. Yeah, I know. His other ex, Denise how, Richards. So. How about you get back to work then, Charlie? Eh? Yeah, and Come another ex before <laughs> that. So, Charlie, don't get married again. Stop that. CeeLo Green isn't just a top nominee for Sunday's Grammy Awards. He's also a last-minute hero for Rihanna and the Women's Cancer Research Fund. The artist behind the song Forget You filled in for Rihanna after she had to cancel her scheduled performance Thursday at the organization's annual fundraising dinner because she had the flu. Both singers are expected to perform during the Grammy ceremony. 45-year-old Glee creator Ryan Murphy has been asked to consider directing a remake of the musical comedy Annie, which will star Willow Smith. And not surprisingly, the project's being co-produced by uh, Willow's parents, Will and Jada Pinkett Smith. Jennifer Aniston says she wants to simplify her life by selling off her Beverly Hills mansion and splitting time between a smaller house in L.A. and an apartment in Manhattan. Penelope Cruz has named her new baby son via actor Javier Bardem, Leo. Simon Cowell says he's only watched three minutes of American Idol this season. Meow. <laughs> and Miley Cyrus tells the March edition of Marie Claire that she regrets smoking saliva, the hallucinogenic herb that's legal in California, because it set a bad example for her young fans. You think? Yeah. That's the Hollywood Hot Seat brought to you by Carpet One and Quinny's Greatest Hits, 95.5 Hits FM.